The last Appalachian unicorn was sighted in 1872 in a small mountain town in southeastern Kentucky, shown here with her keeper. As American robins differ widely in appearance from their British cousins, so do the Appalachian and the European unicorn. While the variety found in the woodlands of Scotland are on the larger end of the spectrum, with some accounts of unicorns as tall as 20 hands high, medieval frescoes from Italy tell us that the unicorns there were smaller, easily held in the arms of a maiden. The Appalachian unicorn is adapted to the rugged terrain of the mountains and became shorter, stouter, and with coarser hair, eventually coming to resemble the modern-day donkey. The Appalachian unicorn, or Unicerus alleghenia by its Latin name, was a largely solitary creature, but was known to bond across species with a single young human in its lifetime. This human was known as its keeper. While still attracted to the pure of heart like its European counterparts, the Appalachian unicorn also favored grit in its keeper, for a precious thing needs a fierce protector. Their lives were tied to one another after bonding, so when one perished, the other followed. They were both deeply blessed and terribly cursed. The opalescent horn, or alicorn, of the Appalachian unicorn is notably shorter than the three-foot specimens held in private collections in Europe, but has much of the same supernatural properties, including an enzyme to purify water. When ground into a powder, it could be used in medicines, a powerful hallucinogenic unless combined with a stabilizer. The alicorn was thus highly sought after and hotly hunted. A common defense tactic among keepers was to rub the creature down with coal from horn to hoof to mask its telltale luminosity. In cross-referencing the Farmer's Almanac, and Thomas Walker's An Incomplete Mountain Bestiary, it seems the appearance of the unicorn often coincides with a historic flood. The latter also mentions their favored diet consists of roughage, blackberries, and cornbread with milk.
Rumors of unicorn sightings have persisted in the area in the time since. Witnesses report feeling an overwhelming sense of calm and peace in the moments before one comes into view, and peripheral vision becomes hazy. History tells us that if approached by a unicorn, you are to sit down, and if it puts its head in your lap and falls asleep, you are its keeper. <laughs>